So first point on the agenda is questions and issues. If anyone has anything. Okay, I guess nobody has nothing. Next is open PRs and issues. I think actually both PRs which I added to the list are from Marosh, but Marosh is not here. So I guess we should take it offline. So I think this one we discussed last time, I tried to reproduce what he was seeing, but I didn't succeed. So I think we need to get back to it and discuss what he's seeing. And then uh, the other one doesn't have review from Tom Bentley who's on PTO now for another week and a half. So I guess the question is, whether it's blocking Marosh in some further work or whether we should wait for them to get back and review it again. Well, if I understood correctly, I think the last step after this PR is to migrate it to different repositories. So basically that's the only thing which is blocked. Yeah, Not I sure. think we need to get back to the whole discussion about about how versioning. versioning, how to do yeah, the yeah. container images and so on. Yeah. And that probably anyway needs to continue on the next community call. Yeah, definitely with Tom. Anyone has any other PRs or issues to discuss? Okay, then the next point on the agenda is the release process improvement. Jakub, I know the last thing which we had opened there was how it fits with the system tests, which you yeah. wanted to think about. Yeah, I was thinking about it. And uh, the only thing which is, uh, let's say kind of problematic is pushing images to some, some repository from where it could be reused uh, with another pipelines. Um, one option is to create, let's say, streams of staging organization on Quai and push uh, the images from uh, release pipelines there and reuse it in uh, in the system test pipelines, which will be uh, triggered for the releases. And another option is to use some uh, Azure Container Registry but I'm not sure if we have uh, enough permissions to create uh, the organization there and reuse it. It's something which uh, uh, we should somehow investigate. But uh, the option with Kwai is, from my point of view, pretty simple. And uh, from my point of view, it's so I, I don't see any problem in it. Aren't the system tests really normally using the internal registry in Minikube? Yes. So why shouldn't they just download the artifacts with the image stars and push it into their local registry? Well, that's that's option as well. So you mean that uh, the image stars will be somewhere in staging environment? and we'll be able to pull it or download it and push the images into Minikube. Yeah, so uh, there are the stupid slides for this. So basically, they will be built here mm -hmm. in this step and they will be stored as a azure pipeline artifact or how whatever it's their name 
uh, and then <clears throat> the further steps, they will basically just download them from there and load them into the local Docker. Mm -hmm. And I think for the system test, the only other thing you would need to do is download them from there, push them into, uh, load them into the local Docker and then push them into the registry as you do it in the regular build. Yeah, that's, that's not a problem, I think it should work. So that, sh that should be basically something what should be used even when with the PR pipeline uh, and so on, I would expect instead of uh, building your own images in the system test, you would mm -hmm. just basically load them from the artifacts. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Uh, do we know if there are some uh, restrictions for the size of the artifacts? I think they are not. Okay, in that case, it should be fine. So I think the rest, there is some time restriction. I think the artifacts for normal builds are deleted after some time. I don't know, after two weeks or something like that. Yeah. But I'm not aware of any size restrictions. Uh, it's uh, two gigs for a free organization. So maybe the the quota will be higher for a CNCF. Yeah, I think it's it's uh, it's different for for us. Yeah, I can try to find it. Okay, so do we have any other unanswered questions to the release process improvements? Nothing from me. <laughs> okay, then I actually edit the point to the agenda about the annual review, <clears throat> uh, which uh, we should do again for this year. But I think we should move that to the next time because a lot of the other maintainers are missing or so that we can discuss who's gonna to draft something and so on. I agree. Unless we wanna volunteer someone who isn't here. Okay, so that's it for the agenda. Does anyone have anything else? Okay, so I guess this was a quick meeting with a lot of people being on PTO. So that's it for today. Thanks for coming. Thanks very much. Bye Thank all. You. See so. you.